Hi, hi. Hello. Welcome. We just finished Etchy Dallas and we bought stuff. We had a good time there. We met so many nice people uh, and it was it was fun. really fun. Uh, it was nice, mature. I mean, if you're a man of culture, I guess I should have said person of culture, but whatever. But <laughs> you will have a good time. This convention was so good. We want to record some shorts. We did record a video that will come up. Mm -hmm. So be ready for the waifu tier list game, which we had a lot of fun playing with everyone. But this was a very nice, wholesome convention, just despite all the nudity. Uh, I think when you're about almost one sneeze away and showing everybody your goods, I think your give a fuck goes out the window. Mm -hmm. But everyone was just so nice. Uh, no screaming kids. Oh, that was and nice. Just, well, Dallas is just such a great place. Don't you love the weather down there? No. Uh, besides the weather. The weather sucked. I tried wearing a uh, Vaporeon uh, romper, I think it's called, which was like kind of fur-ish, and I was dying in it. <laughs> but we want to show you all the goodies that we bought. Speaking of which, I left this one on the steps. Your grand prize, which we will open last. All right. Because you, that's your waifu. Uh, what's one this? of your waifus. One of my waifus? You have so many waifus. Actually, I think, how many do you have? Two for sure. Two for sure. Well, you're starting to really like uh, that new girl from level two, uh, leveling Friend, up. Friendries, yeah. Yeah. Right. I'm just going to call it level two because that's so much easier. We did have to censor a bunch of the stuff that we bought. What should we show off first? Stickers? Uh, I want to do my Pokemon remints. Alright, do your remints first. I'm going to sit up here. Yeah, there was some wholesome stuff there too, not just all nude and lewd. For the, your nice thing. But yeah, they were selling these remints for such a good price. I have never seen remints so cheap, like at our local uh, vintage stock. Um, they sell them for like $25 or $27. The guy at the booth was selling them for 10 bucks. Yeah. Which is the lowest I've ever seen remints go. That's why you had to buy them. Yes. I got two. Two for 20. Let's see what we get. We got Pikachu and Sebelie. Not one of the ones I particularly wanted. Yes, they're random. I was really hoping for Pikachu Eevee, Pikachu Mew, or Pikachu Magikarp. But the Sableye one looks really cool. I like the crystals in the cave. Sableye, not my favorite Pokemon. Why does the Pikachu look like it has like a little dog? Oh, oh, it's a uh, cave. Cave. He's spelunking. I think I have that version of Pokemon Go. <laughs> I have every other version of Pokemon Go. You want to open the other one? Sure. See what we got. Hopefully no dupes. I chose this particular set because I didn't have any from this one. Right. Here. Nope, not a dupe. What'd you get? What'd you get? What'd you get? Magikarp! Yay! One of the ones I was hoping for. <laughs> and I'll be putting these together off to the side while you show off some other stuff. Should we do the stickers next? Yeah, sure. All right, I'll show you the safe for work versions, and we had to center the not safe for work versions. So the stickers. There's a uh, wicked lady. In a nice, like punk outfit. I got this Raptalia here that I have a not safe for work version. I have this. What would you call it? Um. I think it's supposed to be a goth. I think it's like Sailor Moon turned evil. Yeah. If I had to say. Or it could be uh, the uh, Eternal Sailor Moon. And I have a not safe for work version of that. Another goth looking Sailor Moon. Uh, what's what else do I have? I can show. Oh yeah. A. I got a not safe for work version of this Lum. So Lum and Raftalia are definitely 
some of your waifus. What about, do we again? Maja Beza. I think she's my personal waifu. I saw that they were selling, I should have bought the simp card they had for her. <laughs> there you go, Demon Nezik. Um, Nagatora. Nagatora. It was a Nezuko. Man, when we did the tier list, people either like her or fucking hate her. Yeah, it, it was so 50-50 on her. I think this one would be the borderline safe for work I could put on the car. <laughs> okay, those are the safe for work versions. These are the ones we had to censor. My Majibeza. <laughs> I love her. Another one, Major Bazer. That one's holographic. <laughs> and these are gonna have to go on the uh, at the door of our room, not the uh, car, for obvious reasons. Why? Why can't we drive around with boobies? People will get offended real easy in the world we live in. Oh, what are they gonna do? Key my car. I guess there are some people who are that petty that would probably follow us to wherever we're going and do that. Albedo, I think. I did I get another, I thought I had a safe work version of that where she's got a top on, but maybe I didn't. <laughs> and then the last, I think the last one. Now we got some that are hiding over here on my side. Oh, okay. Alright, the newest, I guess, would she be wife of the year? I don't know. I, th I think she didn't place well on our tier list, if I remember correctly. And the reason why I'm censoring this is because the uh, tentacles are going up, up in her. <laughs> okay, let me get this off. Spooking Pikachu. At Cal Albedo. Moo. Uh, Naked Nami. With treasure. And I guess this, is this the last one we got? Yeah, I think so. What's the next? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Same place I got some of those uh, golf Sailor Moon, I got this. And which car are you putting that on? Uh, Snowtown. What, what is it? The fusion. Okay, say that. Or fusion. Oh, you want to show people your shirt I got you? Yes. Oh, wait, no, that's my that's my pillow. Oh, come on. You can't <laughs> show that. He's not naked. You can show it. I think I'm going to show it off. All right. It, it's basically a Sephiroth uh, pillow, body pillow. I thought the other side of it, he was naked. Is he? I did not see that. I'm going to have to examine that because I just saw that he was like laying seductively. All right, I hope he's naked on the other side. That'd be nice. All right. Ooh. This guy. I love that. Lucy and uh, Rebecca from, uh, help me out here. My brain's pooping. Uh, cyberpunk. Cyberpunk. Thank you. Edge runners. Yeah. Edge runners. The good cyberpunk. He is, uh, I can't remember his name. Uh, I think you have his card somewhere here. We no, find but I, I, I looked up his uh, thing. Um, the booth that we bought that from, uh, the guy's making a uh, really cool uh, game on Steam. He's just starting off. Uh, the thing's called Hi uh, Dream Hive Studio on Steam. He actually got the voice actor for uh, uh, Makarov, Whitebeard, and uh, Pixies, and he does some other stuff to voice one of his characters. Uh, was that really, did they see that really good? Yeah, I just saw it. Okay. But I would highly recommend checking out his uh, Steam. I, I think he's got a demo for the game. It's like some kind of like a Galaga shooter uh, kind of uh, uh, lewd uh, game. He's working on a nice story for it. Uh, but I, I'm looking forward to trying that out. We might play that on our channel here. Yep. Honey pop. Oh yeah, he he wanted that. Uh, I was I was referring to. Uh, I can't remember. What, uh, I think it was like, wow, damn it, waifu uh, shooter or something. Uh, damn it, I can't remember the name. But it's a uh, dream hive. Damn it, wh whatever I showed. <laughs> dream hive studio. Dream hive studio. Look that up on Steam. <laughs> and. Uh, 
We might try a live. Let's let's play live stream a roulette when we play this. How long? Uh, oh no. We would get so well. We're not monetized, uh, but we'll just get canceled. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Acrylic standees of Raptalia. And got an Albedo. And Albedo that will go in my collection. Mm-hmm. All right. And then we got. I got you this because I love you. Oh yeah. Was this? Mag oh, this is not magnetic. I got stuck on the truck for some weird reason. Oh, oh, it's resin. Resin. Mm -hmm. Okay. Little resin lump keychain. Uh, there's a. I, I wish we could. Uh, I mean, we could show off some of these uh, business cards. I don't remember who went to what. Well, this one went to that resin keychain. All right. So this went to that resin keychain. If you want to look them up. I thought there's a. Uh, try to get that for you. But everyone was so nice and so wholesome at this convention. I, This was the most friendly convention I've ever been to. Uh, we had a random person give us this card. I guess they were selling stuff. Oh, yeah. They're selling some um, uh, otaku. What is that? Otaku boxes. Otaku what we, boxes. What we used to open up on this channel years ago. Before. Figures. So if you want some little figures that you're looking for. Maybe I'm trying they have to, it. Do you know what stickers this came with? I don't remember, but... We're not sure what stickers we got with this, but if you want to look these people up, here's the QR code if you want to look that up. Magic curb, 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 curb. This magic curb looks so derp! Again, another one. We're not sure what <laughs> we got with them. I'll show off the Seville Eye Cave that I finished. Well... There you go, Sea Bly Cave. Oh, right. I'm having fun with this Magikarp one. I'm trying to figure out how to place it. It's so intricate. I guess I can show off. Oh, oh, she has her card in there too, so she's right. that. All right, I'll, I'll flip it around. She had some really beautiful pictures, but I saw the lum. I was surprised there wasn't that many lums, especially with the remake of the series. She's yeah. so pretty. There, if you want to check out those people. Mm -hmm. Alright, what are we down you, to? You could show, you just, just show the cover. <laughs> I got some naughty uh, reading material that I'm going to have to figure out how to... Uh, Google Translate. Yeah, because it's all in Japanese. I think this one takes place... What are we, in Water 7? Yep, no, no, I think it's like a tour, maybe, I I don't know. Uh, it's definitely before the time skip, so it could be around Alabaster to Water 7, yeah. All right, so you want to show off? Or did you show show them the... Uh, yeah, I already showed no, off. No, no, the... Yeah, I already showed them that. Put together. I'm trying to figure out how to put this in. I'm confused. Here, Here uh, you. you show off something else. All right. Okay, uh, this is, since our channel is not for children, a nice hentai series that we ran into. Definitely check them out. I actually bought the whole set of uh, issues that he had. It was like one through four of this one in particular. I can't show you too much because they are very lewd, very hot. The story was really interesting. See, the unfortunate events of Segura the Witch. But yeah, he he was so nice and his his art is so beautiful. If you want to check out the story, I would highly recommend. Right. I ended up buying all the issues he had. And the carp goes in. Here, I'll just... Oh, yeah, I forgot about these pictures over here. Yep. The, again, everyone was so nice. This guy was doing a... Uh, oh, this big picture. Let's see if we can get that in there was doing a promotion, uh, buy one and you get one free for the first 20 people and that, I was a vendor so it was really easy to be the first, one of the first 20. Got that for Lou. But the poor guy, he was in his booth all by himself. He, it was like me and two other people that had ordered, got some prints and I had, um, he was uh, getting the frames on them and he had to, it, it took him a while. Yeah. So I had to wait there for a while. But yeah, it was understandable because he was so all by himself. The only, my only complaint is 
the convention is because we were vendors. Our sales weren't as good as say we go to Comic Con. Well, it's a brand new convention. Well, I don't have a card for him, but here's his information on the baggie. If I can. Here, down here. The no, on the other side. Well, it's also on this side too. Oh, it is. And here's his socials. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, if, that's. If they could pick up. <laughs> ah, I got flopped in the head. All right. But those were really beautiful prints. There you go, finish. Carp. You Bloop. All right, what are we down to? Uh, figures. Go ahead and start opening these. This is a free. This is a freebie bag we got. It wasn't freebie. I wanted at uh, Anime Bingo. Okay, I know I had the uh, knife around here. Can I? I think it's maybe on my side. I have scissors right here. Yeah, scissors work. I grabbed the knife. All right. Anyway, um, first one up. Is Uta. Schoolgirl Uta? Schoolgirl Uta. Let's see what she looks like. We at least made uh, the money back that we invested, so it was like a. We broke even. Yeah, more or less. It was more just. Normally we would sell. Well, of course, like you said, newer convention. And it wasn't just us, it was other people who were saying the same thing. Mm -hmm. So. I could say there was another reason for it, but I don't want to be a controversial channel. We're not political. But you know what I'm talking about if you know. Mm -hmm. yeah. Alright. Oh, yeah, they. Yay, you get to put stuff together. Mm -hmm. Show it off the camera. Let me see. Cute little Pikachu fishing a magic carp. So cute. Alright. See the what box. Now put stuff together. and then the head. All right, put the wings in the back. I think they're pretty self-explanatory. I was question why they can't ship these in one piece. Hmm? I don't know, just the we Oh, why they have to be in... It's probably so they don't break. Alright. And that is the schoolgirl Uta. Yeah. Uh probably should do the genie rim and ram. Ooh, I'll get this one. Alright. Tell me my knife's quite somewhere stupid. Anyway. We got these uh booth oh, together. There's the sticker. Yep. Sticker on the bottom. Well, I would hope people wouldn't be selling fake stuff. At you never know. Well, well, you, we saw remember? at Comic Con, yes. So yeah. The fake Alberto, I think, what it was. He was charging almost. Oh, these are all. These were a little more expensive, but I can see why they're all put together. Plus what five dollars off? Yeah. Can't collect these boxes. Well, luckily we have more room in our basement for all these. Alright. I swear looking at the genie versions of them just makes me play the uh uh Bucci Geary theme song in my head. <laughs> If anyone's seen that anime, it's really cute. 
kind of like Tokyo Revengers except with genies. And there is the Ram genie version. Oh, I caught her. Cute. Also, I love the details and the. I, I love figures that have that clear. Uh, um, Look. Like, yeah, details. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Mainly because I'm a shiny obsessed. <laughs> so Anything that looks shiny just gets to me. Why is Ram. Why is she in a red outfit? I don't know. That seems weird. I thought they would be in like uh, each other's alternate colors. Because she's like in a pinkish outfit. I thought she'd be in blue, not red. Alright, and here we go, another glittering glamorous lum. I mean I had the box right in front of me, but I wasn't paying attention. I'll take care of it when you're doing. Okay. Unless did I get the wrong one? No, you got the right one. Hmm. Look at the box over there. Because my brain's mooing that there was another they had a second ram. Hmm. No, I think you got the right one. Another right. same logo. Box. Yeah. And bubble wrap. Oh, that one's gonna be easy to put together. Yum. This one, baby. I saw this one as we walked in and the guy gave me a good deal on it <laughs> and when I looked it up online it's actually the same price of what I got it for online mine is shipping too so that takes care of the weight also Give my Sephiroth body pillow, damn it. Uh, did I throw it behind me? Did I threw it over there. Oh. You look at that while I... Mm -hmm. Now I need to find out if it, it does have a double-sided. I saw some of them were double-sided where you bought that from. I did not see that. If this has a double-sided, I'm going to be really happy. Okay, this one's going to be kind of detailed. Oh wow, look at all the little pieces this one has. Ooh. Yeah, I'm excited for that one. It's so intricate and pretty. Alright. Yeah, I love that it's all rainbow clear electricity. Oh uh, yeah, I love that one. It's so pretty. Let's get this. I can get too much. Yeah. So you really have no real complaints about, hell, we didn't even get woke up at night in the hotel room. Yeah, barely. Oh, the other side just has them uh, Ow. in clothes. It's actually more clothes than the other side. Darn, I was hoping for a dick. Wings covering up his best part there. Mm. Well, I got, I mean, he already has his chest showing out in his outfit. This is actually a pretty big pillow. Case. No one's actually seeing it. I don't think I, I don't think I have a pillowcase that big. I like Sephiroth. Leave me alone. Yeah. All right. And the other side just has him naked, except his wings covering his crotch, which is so unfair. Get all the zitties out and the weird neon sun. So silky. All right. I think I need to buy a new pillow for the bed because I think this. Where is, is it going to go on the bed? They'll find a way. 
He can he can uh, he can sleep on top of your waifus. <laughs> Did you already cut the tape? Not yet. Oh, I'm trying to find the tape. May not have tape. No, I found one. It does. And as. Ah. The one thing I'm sad though, there was ten times more female characters than there were male. I should start. We should start selling male characters. Of course, that's coming from a booth that had nothing but female characters too. Yeah. Okay, can this can only go in one way. Let me see that. Here. I was just. I specifically really, really want to find the Sephiroth figure, but it's like sold out on the website, and then uh, trying to find a website that. Uh, Sells it. Yeah. I, I just really want this naked Sephiroth figure. I'm gonna only have a naked long figure. They do have it. Well, we can print it off for you. Oh yeah, we have a 3D printer. <laughs> I guess technically I could try to print a. I mean, I'd have to alter it for myself since I don't think I can find a naked Sephiroth on its own. So I'll have to find a nice hot male body that I like, and then just get Sephiroth's head on and it. And put him with cloud. No. <laughs> it's canon. No. Why is that? Why do people ship Cloud and Sephiroth? What do you mean it's canon? It's not canon. <laughs> <laughs> slap you. Yeah, I guess I'm weird in that regard. I like my Yuri, but I don't care for Yaoi. Hey, if you like it, that's good on you. It's just not my thing. All right, and the piece of resistance. So, you want to call it here? Yep. Good. Thank you for joining us. Uh, if you can put your head down. Bye. Bye.